Okay, so in this video we're going to be talking about Grand Theft Auto V, which is also known as GTA V. So this is a groundbreaking open world game that to many people has captured the hearts and minds of so many players worldwide. This game is developed by Rockstar Games, and this title offers an unmatched gaming experience that blends the emerging story with an immersive online multiplayer component that is known as GTA V Online. So in GTA V, players are transported into the design city of Los Santos. From the moment you step into the virtual world, you're taking you're, you're taken to a living and breathing environment brimming with endless possibilities and thrilling challenges. So the city of Los Santos is based on Los Angeles, which is obviously in California. And whether you embark on the epic single player journey or also you can dive into the ever expanding online realm, that this game of GTA V will promise an unforgettable experience. So the online component allows players to seamlessly transition between a captivating single player campaign and a sprawling multiplayer playground. Within this open world and online world, you'll discover a thriving community of players, each carving their own path to fame and fortune. So GTA 5 Online offers a wide range of activities and challenges that you can participate in. Some to mention are heist, high stake robberies against rival gangs and some organizations, and you can also put your driving and flying skills on the test of the streets and skies of Los Santos. So what truly distinguishes GTA 5 Online is the unparalleled freedom it provides its players. You can customize your character's appearance, you can acquire extravagant properties, and expand an immersive arsenal of weapons and vehicles. You can also engage in player-created missions, races, and events that you can put that you can put your creativity and strategic prominence to the test. One of the standout features in GTA 5 Online is that its commitment to providing players with a constant stream of updates and fresh content. Rockstar Games understands the importance of keeping players engaged and excited, which is why they consistently introduce new gameplay features, events, and expansions. Some of the regular updates ensure that the players always have something new and excited to anticipate. From thrilling heists to new exciting vehicles and weapons, the world of GTA 5 Online always is evolving. Rockstar Games actively listens to its community for feedback and incorporates players' suggestions into their updates, tailoring the experience to the desires of the player base. These updates not only allow content, but also enhance existing features, ensuring that the game remains fresh and captivating to its players to make sure that they always stay engaged and they don't get bored of the game. Whether it's introducing new missions, races, modes, or entirely new gaming mechanics, this game of GTA 5 Online consistently surprises and captivates its players. And as players eagerly go await the next installment of GTA 6, in the, in the series, they can rest assured that GTA 5 Online will continue to receive the updates, providing new adventures, challenges, and opportunities for social interaction. This game truly sets the bar from open world experiences, offering the best of what the genre has to offer, and the genre being open world games. It stands as a pinnacle of the genre, offering an unmatched level of freedom, endless possibilities, and a thriving online, c online community. Adding on to what Saeed said about the wide range of freedom the online mode offers, it is also more diverse with the option of playing as a female character, which the story mode doesn't have. This inclusion of diversity helps improve the gaming community, making people feel more included and welcomed. Other games also offer that option like Call of Duty and Destiny for example, but GTA 5 did it 10 years ago. And strong sources say that GTA 6's story will offer a Bonnie and Clyde character theme where it can play as a female character, which gives her a more important role. What's special about GTA's online mode is you can create your own character while having the same personality with the actions you make, the type of music you listen to in the car or radio, what weapons you like, and your taste in real estate and cars. And going into more detail about what Said says, you can also run your businesses like owning nightclubs, marijuana farms, and there's even a CEO option where you have other players work for you serving as Hitman, which pays them. And my favorite is running heists with friends. It's, and it's the same open world map. And this gives much more freedom than in real life because it's easy to make more money and it offers thrill and excitement. It is not fun stopping during a red light or acting like NPCs in the game. The story mode is very limited because of the assigned missions and specific roles each character has and does not have as many features as the, on as the online mode does either. On top of GTA Online being so popular, on PC there are mods where you can obtain any car, 
jet, gun, or amount of money which will come to you. There are also roleplay servers where players can roleplay as police officers, robbers, and families like mirrored couples, and even try to live a double life in the game. According to Dexero.com, it's hard to get into the Deep League roleplay servers because you must prove yourself to be a good roleplayer by staying in character and not messing around killing other players or destroying their cars, which is very tempting for someone like me. The servers also are also competitive to join as well. There are multiple Reddit forums and websites that can help players enter. As you can see, my character lives in a high-rise apartment with a garage that stores a couple of cars, but it doesn't compare to what other players that own yachts, military planes, 100-car garages, and other high-value items in the game. My character doesn't have a lot of funds to run businesses, but luckily there are many ways to make in-game income like the real world, for example, going to the casino, playing spin the wheel, blackjack, or betting in horse races. I can also rob convenience stores or, part or par participate in online game activities like heists, car races, and deathmatch paintball servers. The features in GTA 5 Online can consider the game acting like a metaverse. The only times I hop on GTA is when I want to clear my mind by committing violence and crime, which is the purpose of the game. Mainly running people over, breaking into the military base or airport trying to steal planes, and enjoying the free roam around the cities or mountains like I'm playing Microsoft's Flight Simulator. It serves as a stress relieving experience. Grand Theft Auto V is widely regarded as one of the best open world video games due to its immersive gameplay, expansive environment, and the freedom it offers to players. While it may seem like a game primarily focused on things like crime and violence, it can also be seen as a reflection of the human desire for things like exploration, agency, and the exploration of moral boundaries even. <clears throat> as far as the vast open world, one of the key reasons Grand Theft Auto V is considered the best open world game is its incredibly detailed and expansive map. The game takes place in the fictional city of Los Santos, which is supposed to be an imitation of a combination of like Los Angeles, Beverly Hills, Hollywood area. <clears throat> that city, Los Santos, and its surrounding areas offer a very diverse range of environments, from busy urban areas to serene countryside and beautiful deserts. This vastness symbolizes the limitless possibilities and opportunities for exploration that the game provides for players. Diving into the topic of freedom and agency, Grand Theft Auto V grants players a high degree of freedom and agency within its world. Here's how. Players can choose to engage in the main story missions or venture off on their own, exploring the city, interacting with NPCs and participating in a wide array of activities so like racing, uh, heists, and even leisurely activities like golf or yoga you can even do in the game. This freedom reflects the human desire for autonomy and the ability to shape our own experiences. Grand Theft Auto V can additionally be seen as a reflection of the exploration of moral boundaries. And as far as this moral exploration goes, GTA V dives into complex moral themes, allowing players to make choices that can have consequences within the game world. The narrative presents a morally ambiguous world where characters must navigate their own values and principles. By examining the consequences of their actions, Players can explore ethical dilemmas and reflect on their own personal values, questioning the boundaries of what's right and what's wrong in the game and in real life. Overall, GTA V's openness extends beyond just its physical open world, inviting players to engage in exploration, freedom of agency, and introspection. By providing a vast playground for freedom, moral choices, and social commentary, it encourages players to think critically and reflect on their own values and the societies that they live in. This multifaceted approach to openness contributes to 
its reputation as one of the best, if not the best, open world video game ever created.